Hi all. Uh, in this video, we are going to discuss about block tag in Django. What is the need of block tag? The thing is, if you are creating a web page, uh, here I haven't created any header or footer or anything, right? Okay, so. Uh, if we have 10 pages in your site we need to provide uh, or repeat same header content same footer content in all the templates right here we have couple of templates we have created a couple of templates okay one is uh, product list and uh, one another is product detail page right this thing okay so in all the pages we have to provide same uh, I mean inside the body we need to provide a header and uh, after pro displaying the content we need to provide a footer for the web page right so uh, do you think that uh, is it a good practice to repeat the same content in all the pages right instead of that what we can do we can create a common template for a website okay so that is what I'm going to do okay in order to do that, I'm going to create. So here we have what are the URL patterns we have at present. So let's see. Now if we type 8000, I'm getting admin ABC products here ABC. I'm going to see this form. Okay. So we have. So the server is not running. I'm going to start the server. Server is not running. Okay, it doesn't slash. Okay. Okay. Home products and product list. Okay. So here I'm going to create a template, a common template for all of my pages. Here home is what home what i have provided in the home this is my page this is the first thing we created right okay so uh, if you remember uh, we had created a template folder earlier okay so i uh, insert that particular template folder i'm going to create an html file okay my site html okay inside uh, this particular body section i'm providing a block tag there is this is a, a django tag okay block we can provide some name okay i'm providing name as main main for main content or something okay Okay, I'm simply typing main. It's similar to for and for th this is block and block. Okay. So here I'm providing h1 slash h1. Okay. header footer okay. and uh, in between header and footer of the page I have a a block called main okay here we have created a, a template called my site right now what I'm going to do is in the home page what is the home page template home page template is in type home this is my page dot html right so my page dot html my page dot html is i put it in this particular page itself right okay now what i'm going to do is that 
I'm going to delete all these things. Okay. And here I'm going to provide extends extends what extends my site dot html okay so actually that means my page extends this particular html template and that particular template has a block called main okay i'm just copying that okay and uh, putting that here okay and in the main block head in the main block we are providing some message here okay some this is my home page okay so this is my home page which one okay now if you look at i'm going to refresh the page now we can see header and footer this is coming from header and footer section is coming from this particular parent page called my site.html okay this is the a template page okay inside this template page i have a a block named main okay and uh, this uh, my page.html extend that template and it is providing a content for the block named main okay here block named main okay so we can name anything like main instead of that you can provide main content or uh, page content or whatever the name here if the uh, if the block name is main content we need to use here it is main content okay i hope you got an idea it's similar to uh, one class inherit another class right in object oriented program similarly here one template inherit this particular template inherit from this particular template and this template has certain placeholders in those placeholder this particular template provide what content to be applied so actually django template render uh, apply this particular uh, content in the in this particular html template and uh, provide that as a html response okay i hope you got some idea about how to create or how to use block tag okay for example if you want to change the title okay so what we can do here in say title we can provide block i can provide uh, some name here title i'm providing title itself and block okay uh, here i am providing uh, something like my site okay okay and when you look at this particular earlier it was title okay now title is my title sorry my site and uh, if you change so here if you open home 
I'm getting my site, right? So uh, if you want to change this thing in the, this is just a placeholder, right? So in the home page, we are rendering this particular template, right? So while rendering this particular template, we can provide what title should be there in the home page. So I can provide my shop. Okay. So home page uses this, this particular template and this particular template extends my site and my site has a section or block called title that is this particular area right there we are providing my shop okay now if you look at uh, here instead of my site we can see after refreshing it should be my shop okay so i hope you got an idea about how to uh, create a, a django template okay and uh, and how that can be extended in other templates okay i hope uh, you got some idea thanks for watching this